Hey guys, um, dang, I'm really giving like an egghead here, but, um, okay, you know those like turtlenecks that are like fake turtlenecks and, um, like they go down to like here? Well, that's what this is, but I like to use it like if I'm doing my face, you know, like if I'm in the process of washing it or doing like a skincare routine because it, it's actually like really good for like keeping the hair back and stuff so that's what i'm using this for to explain it and i'm also putting on gloves because um i guess i should get into it so i'm gonna be doing this on camera so i found like a skin like a face mask um made with Turmeric, honey, and lemon. Oh, it smells like turmeric. I hate it. It just smells really bad, actually. But, um, I'm going to be doing that on camera. I've done it twice already. I did it last week. Um, I did it last week. Give me a second, guys. Sorry, I just got some text and so I was like distracted. Um, I did it twice last week because I had found it on I don't know, I was just looking up like a homemade face mask, and my face is doing pretty well, like, it's not bad, like, it's not I don't know, but I'm also using um, this survey. It's the Renewing Cleanser for normal skin. So I use this, wash my face, then put on the turmeric, then wash my face again, and I'm good. Charles is calling my bestie, but like I'm in the process of doing my skincare routine. It's gonna be a big for you too. I'll call you later. So I do this once before I wash my face and then once after. And I also just do this like every day, pretty much, or every day I remember. Cause I honestly, I'm a every time I remember type of skincare routine girl or whatever. Like I, I usually forget. And so, yeah, but um, I'm out here trying, especially cause for school, I'm not wearing a face mask anymore. So usually I get acne like down here, like specifically my nose area. And so I could just, my face mask covers it, so I don't have to worry, but this year I'm not doing face mask. So, I'm trying to take care of my skin, guys. Help me out. Help a girl out. If you have any tips, leave them in the comments. Um, I guess I'll get started. You can skip this part because I'm just going to wash my face, and I don't feel like splitting the video into two and then going in and making it into one. So it's just gonna be a long while of me washing my face. Also my sink, the faucet, my dad like redid the faucet thing and he made it to where you can't do hot water because um, I don't know, something about a bubble being trapped or something. And he hasn't fixed it. As some winter's coming up, it's gonna be freezing. But I'm gonna have to suffer here. So um, you can just skip this part. Oh my god, it's freezing. It hurts. It hurts, guys. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm.
Okay guys, I'm back. Um, I just did like a quick little wash. And then I just pat my face to dry. Cause I don't wanna, I don't wanna do it like too rough. And then like kill my face. This is an up close visual of my skin. Usually I get acne like right like here in my nose. Oh, you can see my acne sores. Cause then I always pick up, pick at it. But um, oh, it's disgusting. I really, I just don't enjoy turmeric. It smells. So, but we're good. We're chilling. We're fine. We're not fine. We're not fine at all. Oh, also they make turmeric, they make mustard out of turmeric, so it kind of has like a faint mustardy smell and I hate mustard, so. Also, don't know if you guys are interested in books, but um, I started this book and it's so good. It's called The Witch's Heart by like Genevieve something. And it's so, like, so I have a soft spot. Gotta get that double chin, guys. You know, it's, it's, it's prominent, so I have to get it. Cause then, like, imagine. Also, turmeric is supposed to, this, this mask is supposed to help with, um, like, hyperpigmentation in certain areas and evening out skin color, skin tone, whatever. So... Imagine I just missed out on my double chin. Completely different color. No, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. But I'm not kidding. Anyway, so this book is really good. It's like, it's delicious. I am i can't get enough of it. I started reading yesterday and then I'm like kind of hooked yesterday. But then today I started reading more and it's so good. And I had to stop it on like, like an amazing part. Cause I was, I had to pack up after school. Which by the way, school is sucking. Cause tell me why I'm sitting alone for one of my lunches. Cause like I'm on an A day, I'm on an A day and B day schedule, and I sit alone for like B day, which is the day I have like all my classes with my best friend, except for lunch. I'm like, what? Why couldn't it have been like literally any other day? Also, we have a pep rally for a day. <sighs> I'm just not about that life, dude. Not about that life. Oh, is this it? Oh my god, am I done? Can I get that nose? Okay, wait, I think I'm done. Hmm. Wow. That's crazy. Let me wash my hands. Or the gloves. Because I, I just want to reuse these gloves because there's no point. In, there's no point in, you know. You get it, guys. Also, my phone is like at 1%, so if the video randomly dies, it's because I didn't feel like recording another part after charging my phone and everything. Just know that it'll turn out fine. Also, after I use this mask, my face turns out so soft. Like, it turns out, because I was really scared. I was also scared of it staining my face, because I mean, look at the gloves. But actually, if you just like wash your face thoroughly, especially with the like CeraVe cleanser after this, your face is, like my face felt so smooth and I, my face has not been like that recently. Like recently, I don't know, I, I, I put a lot of products on it like a while ago and then my face just got... And then also I think it was a combination of getting older, but it's fine. Cause I'm also using this Josie Moran. It's 
whipped argan oil face butter so it's specifically for your face and this is juicy peach but i did have a cucumber one it's ultra hydrating but i don't put that all over my face because i use it to do gua sha on my face but i focus on my jawline because if i put this on my because i do gua sha like every day so if i put this all over my face every single day i start to get like a lot of like i start to break out because it, my face gets really oily that's why I use a cleanser every day. Because <laughs> my face gets really oily. And if I'm not like washing it, then I break out. But um, I just use this around here, like my jawline, jawline area. Um, and I don't really break out there. So it works out fine. Oh, this book I was talking about. So this book is delicious. Oh, and I'm also using this Karma X. My lips are getting, we're getting really like kind of like dry because i never use them but also i've been licking my lips a lot anyway <laughs> let's go with that ignore what is that but anyway oh also check out these cute little earrings i have they're little water oh i have to watch the time okay you're supposed to put it on for like three minutes I think it's been two minutes i'll just wait for it oh, i got it in my eyebrow hair also my eyebrows suck like i've been using the inverted filter so i can get used to like how other people see my face and it's a blow to the self-esteem every time dude every time but um my eyebrows look so uneven let me there's a mirror behind so I prefer this eyebrow. I prefer this eyebrow. This eyebrow is personally just my favorite one. That might sound weird, but it is what it is, guys. It is what it is. So this book, it's called The Witch's Heart. It's really good. I love, I'm a sucker for books who follow a side character in a popular story. So I read The Song of Achilles, which was really like popular not too long ago. I don't know if it still is. It was so good. It followed Patroclus and Achilles' story. So his like lover, his man. And then I also read Circe, who was a minor character in, I think it was Odysseus' story. And then I... And then I read The Dark Descent of Elizabeth Frankenstein, which was Victor Frankenstein, the guy who made the monster, his wife. And it followed her story and everything she did, stuff like that. So I'm a sucker for stories that follow the side character. Like, I love it. So The Witch's Heart follows Loki's wife. So Loki, like, if you watch Marvel, Thor's brother, except this is following the Norse, North? No, Norse mythology. So... It's not like the Marvel, but it still has the same characters. So in, in the Norse mythology, Loki's actually Thor's uncle, like Odin's blood brother. And um, it's really good, dude. Like, the story is really good. I recommend it. Like, I'm, I'm kind of halfway through, I think. And I love it already. Also, I'm going to wash this out real quick. You can skip this part. Also, while I'm like washing this out, like after I wash it all completely my, on my face, then I use the survey and start like scrubbing. I'm not scrubbing, but you know.
back at it again, guys. If you're still here, wow. That surprises me. Okay. Get my towel. Okay. And then after this, I just do the gouache on. On my face. But, like, you can follow any tutorial. Like, I... I kind of have, like, the movements memorized now. So, literally, I just follow, like, a TikTok tutorial. And they all use, like, oil, but I haven't found an oil that is good. Like, I had used an rosemary oil one time, and it made my face break out really badly, actually. That's, like, never happened to me, bruh. Never. Like, it was clearly, like, it wasn't just an accumulation of, like, oil. It was, like, a bunch of, like, little, like, I don't know if you would call it hives. It looks like I'm about to shave or something. But I like to just put, like, a ton of lotion on. Just, like, all over, because I go all the way down to, like, my collarbone. I'm gonna just start with like, and I do 10 each side. Also guys, so I was sitting at this like area in my school and I got the corner seat right. And so this other dude comes in and he's like the student aide. So basically like he helps, it's the counselor's area. So he does like errands for the counselors and stuff, but really he just kind of sits there for most of the time on his phone and so he came in and he usually normally gets the corner seat even though there's a specific spot where aids are supposed to sit so he usually takes my spot and but this time i beat him to it because we had a meeting and so i got there early um and so then this other girl her she's really annoying i don't want to be mean but she's really annoying i don't know she's kind of condescending too so she comes in and she sits next to him and she opens up her lunch and stuff and and she starts talking to him and she's like hi i'm gonna use fake names so she was like hi seth um and her name is um what name shall i give her anina that fits her um so her name is like anina and and she was like, hi, Seth, um, how are you doing, like, <sighs> but she was just, like, so talkative, and it was early in the morning, too, um, and so he was just, like, I, I didn't hear him talking, but I wasn't looking at them, because I didn't want to be, like, awkward and just stare, so I just figured he was talking kind of silently, right, and so she's like, hi, how's your day, you don't talk, do you not talk? And I just, like, at that point, I didn't hear him talking. So I, like, look up. And I realize he's looking at her, like, he's on his phone like this. And he's, like. And he has, like, a visible look of disgust on his face. And so I was, like, I love Seth. Like, I love him. Like, realistically, he probably would look at me like that, too. But the fact that it was her. Like, he was looking at her like that. I was, like, Seth. Buddy, you've earned my respect. And she's like, I'm just trying to be, um, what do you call it? Oh my God, what do you call it? Um, not talkative. Friendly? Yeah, I'm just trying to be friendly. And he st like continued to look at her like that. And so I looked back down and then she, and then she was like, hey girl, to me. And I was like, I was like, oh, hi. And she was like, how are you doing? And I was like, good you she said well she said how's your senior year doing going and i was like good you and she was like good good and i was like okay i didn't even say okay i was just went like and then went back to like my work because i was like oh please god no please don't talk to me <laughs> no but that was it that was it um then she went and talked to the counselor about some stuff and i know he was glad that she was like leaving i was like I was too. I didn't feel like talking. Seth and I have a mutual understanding. He doesn't talk to me and I don't talk to him. 
Like, it's perfect. We get each other. We're besties now. But, um, clearly she didn't think so. She didn't agree with the mutual understanding. Honestly, I lost track of how many times I did this on my face. I'm supposed to be counting. Nine, right? Ten. I think I did ten on the side, too. I don't know anymore, but it's fine. And then I just do this to like my collarbone. My face gets really red. That's because I'm going kind of like hard, even though I know you're not supposed to. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I'm trying to hurry up because I want to go upstairs and play Red Dead. Because my cousin let me get Red Dead and it's actually really good, dude. Like, you get to do so much. Like, it's really interactive. And it's not like you have, like, a set rules and have to do set, like, a number of things. You There's, like, different side quests that you get to do, too. And there's just so much to do and so much. Like, you can get rich. Um, not to flex or anything, but currently I am rich. Nine. Ten. Right? That was ten, right? Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Okay, I'm done with that. That's like all I do. At least my skin feeling tight. Guys, ignore that. Ignore that. And then with the like, Carmex, I just go, because I have, I have pretty thin lumps anyway, so. And it's not like I'm trying to like make it look good or anything, because at the point, like I'm trying to get it like all over, because my, I had up getting really chapped lips like right here. And when I was in like fifth grade, my lips got so chapped right here that it ended up looking like I had a mustache, but really it was like just like a scab. I look so rough. Mm -mm. My dogs are going crazy. They go crazy at everything though. Okay, that's my skincare routine. If you guys have any comments on it or like that aren't negative, any, um, things I should try out, um, let me know. I'm interested. Okay, bye. Have a good day or night whenever you're watching this. A good week. Okay, bye.